Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel, coming at you with some more breaking news from New York Comic Con. We've got Marvel Comics uh, just having announced their next big event. So there's going to be a big one, there's going to be a lot of tie-ins, but for now we only have like kind of the basic title and some promo art, a creative team behind it. So it's going to be a quick one, we really don't have too much info on this event so far, but I thought I'd announce this to you guys uh, for anyone who hasn't seen the announcement themselves already. So in spring 2024, Jed McKay, Pepe Larraz, and Marte Gracia launch Blood Hunt, a Marvel Comics crossover event. So Jed McKay is probably my favorite writer at Marvel, honestly. He's behind a lot of their biggest titles right now. Uh, Moon Knight, Doctor Strange, and most importantly, Avengers, right? So he's bringing together a lot of these big players in this event that's going to be involving Marvel vampires, it looks like. So we haven't really had that in a while. It does seem like an interesting premise. Uh, so here's our description so far. Vampires have always walked amongst the shadows of the Marvel Universe, but in spring 2024, the long night arrives, and these blood-sucking terrors will endure the spotlight like, ne like never before. The main event series will be brought to life by an A-team of Marvel talent, current Avengers scribe Jed McKay, and acclaimed X-Men artist Pepe Larraz and Marte Gracia. So um, they're kind of taking Pepe Larraz away from what he could have been doing on um, all the Fall of X stuff that's been happening so that he can do this event. Maybe he's wanting to branch out or something. But um, here's the promo art we have so far. Crazy looking artwork here by Laniel Francis Yu, and we have a logo for Blood Hunt. It really looks like this is just all of the vampires in the Marvel Universe are going to be uh, involved in some way. It might be kind of a more of a like New York City thing, uh, since Doctor Strange and Moon Knight are going to be so heavily involved. Uh, and I'm really just curious to see like how Jed McKay is going to be able to tie in most of his ongoing series, which I assume he's going to do, right? We don't have any tie-ins announced, but um, it looks like they're going to be doing some miniseries tying in and everything also. In classic Marvel fashion, Blood Hunt will also spill out into a host of tie-in issues. Hopefully not too many, but that is classic Marvel fashion. In Marvel's hottest current series and see the launch of an all-new limited series, one-shots and redefining status quos. Brimming with unsurmountable stakes, this startling saga will, dra will drag the world into darkness as your favorite heroes struggle to ward off the vampire race's crusade of terror. So, DC recently did a similar thing with Night Terrors. I know that was more of like a nightmare type thing, but it seems like both of the big two are really leaning in on like super dark events that involve like nightmarish scenarios for the heroes and everything. Uh, but here's what Jed McKay has to say so far about this event. Um, we have vampires in our books all the time. There's some bad blood there. What happens if, th what happens if the shoe was on the foot? We've got the Avengers, uh, Moon Knight's Midnight Mission, Doctor Strange, Miles Morales, and of course Blade. And there's going to be much more vampires than you can shake a stick at. I'm really excited for this. So far, honestly, great creative team behind the main series. Hopefully they don't publish too many tie-ins, but Marvel usually overdoes it, so we'll see what happens there. Let me know what you guys are thinking of this announcement, and I will keep you updated as we get more uh, tie-ins and actual details revealed. But let me know what you think so far down in the comment section below. If you've been enjoying the content and got some good info from this video, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below as well, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.